Hello guys, Stone here. I've just arrived at the OnePlus 3 pop-up event in London and there's a little bit more people than expected today. Let me just show you what the queue is about. Yeah, and basically the queue is double-sided and uh, of course we are at the, at the bottom of it. So, check how many people came to see the OnePlus 3 in life. And uh, considering the store that they're gonna show it up in, I'm really not sure if all of us is going to be able to, to check it out, really. And I'm really not sure how much time it's gonna take because the event is supposed to finish at 10 o'clock. And I think that three hours, no way gonna be enough for all of us to actually uh, check it out so bear with me okay that's the opening there's the countdown <laughs> okay so there's the first people who come in coming in the store I have no idea for how long they've been waiting to to get in but um yeah it seems like an epic moment now let's see yeah so basically there's the saw as you can see, it's not very big, but uh, yeah, there are a couple of hundred people over here. And myself, I'm at the back of the queue, unfortunately, which continues down that street over here. Um, so yeah, I'm not even sure if I'm going to be able to touch it in person today. But anyways, it's available to buy right from the one for store anyway, so... Um, yeah, and that's the end of the queue, guys. I might just pop in over here to get a beer while I'm waiting. See you guys a little bit later on. Okay, guys, so unfortunately the OnePlus 3 event is over for me simply because we've waited for one and a half hours. It's almost nine o'clock now, uh, and we were not even halfway through the queue. So the event closes at 10 o'clock, and there was no way we will be able to see the phone and to touch it and to see how it is. But what we did was just before we went, um, we just went to the back of the store and uh, basically the people who were coming in the store were coming to the main gate and people who already bought the phone were coming through the back exit. So we went through the back and we managed to spoke to the guy uh, who just apparently bought the phone. And basically uh, I finally managed to touch it with my hand and to see, to see very, very quickly how it is. And uh, my initial impressions are pretty good. I mean, the device is very, very slim, like that slim. It's very sleek and nice, the display is brilliant, however, I found out that the top bezel was like that big and when you look at the phone you're like, oh that bezel, I mean, it was really really big guys. Um, but anyway, it's getting cold so we decided to beat it and um, I'm not quite sure if I'm going to be able to buy it to be honest with you because I like the phone. 309 pounds is the current price in the UK, in the US is 399 I think for a lot of device. But uh, I'm not very convinced, plus I've just pre-ordered my V10, so... Uh, <laughs> I mean, let me see, let me see how it goes, and uh, if I buy one, I'm gonna do a video straight away to let you guys know of what my thoughts are and my impressions. So that was it for today, thank you very much for watching, guys. Hit the like button if you like the video, hit the subscribe button for more coverage like that, and uh, I wish you have a good day. Bye-bye, adios.